today we're talking about weight and that is weight loss and achieving and maintaining a healthy body weight in an ethical and efficient and um, very positive way. So a lot of my clients this time of year come to see me because they want to lose weight um, because summer is around the corner and we want to look good in our swimming costumes or um, in our shirt around town or in a nice dress. We want to feel better about ourselves and the people that come and see me are people, just ordinary people like you and me. But the one thing they do have in common is that they have um, normally tried several diets before they come and see me and normally over a period of years. Um, diets work brilliant short term for some people. Short term, if you stick to a diet within about six months, you will probably lose between five and 10% of your body weight, which is really good. It's really good going. Um, so if you're working towards a specific goal, like a wedding or something, then short term diets can be very effective, but why not long term? We hear about people every now and again that went on a certain diet and they lost weight and they maintained that weight loss. We hear about them almost like legends and it makes us want to do that diet. We hear about those people because it's so rare. It's really rare. In fact, only one in a hundred people on any diet will actually lose weight and keep that weight off. One in a hundred. A hundred to one. Would you bet on that horse? I'm not sure I would. There's got to be an easier way, hasn't there? Between one third and two thirds of people about a year or two years after they've been on a successful diet will regain their weight and put on even more weight than when they started. And that's really worrying, isn't it? And it's a bit demotivating. So why is it? Well, I'm here to tell you one of the main reasons why that happens is because of the psychology behind weight loss. Most of these diets don't teach us um, how our body responds to losing weight. Hypnotherapy, on the other hand, can really slow down your thought patterns surrounding weight. It can help you understand how your mind is working, how your body responds to weight loss, um, the restriction of food and the impact that has on our that has on our um, mindset and even the chemicals that are released in the mind. And we go on as well, obviously, to look at habits and behaviours, emotional eatings. Um, there, there are patterns of behaviour that are unique to you and they're not addressed with diet plans. So if you want to lose weight in a really easy way, um, and it might not be quick, but it will be effective and it will be long term, hypnotherapy just teaches you to understand your body and your mind. It helps you to really hear your unique appetite and to understand your unique approach to food. And it helps unravel some of those past behaviors and habits that you had. But not only that, it's not just about losing weight, it's about feeling better in yourself. It's about having realistic goals, not just about what size you want to be and how you want to look, but about how you want to be feeling in six months time. If you want to lose weight in a really um, nice, calm way, then I would really suggest that you use techniques such as hypnotherapy or diet plans that include a psychological aspect to them. It's so much safer, it's a better use of your time so that you're not coming back here to watch this video in five years time or 10 years time. You're not having to watch what you eat. You're just eating naturally, listening to your appetite, stopping eating when you're full and eating healthily when you're hungry. Um, I hope that helps. Anyway, if you want to learn more about um, the techniques I use or um, how it might work for you, then please just drop me an email or something or give me a ring. Um, the number's at the end of the video and the email's there too. Um, great, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed.